Welcome back. Oshay, can you hear me? I can hear you, sorry. Okay, fantastic. Now, what we have done so far is first we create BDD Cucumber test project. Then we go to pom.xml file. Then grab all the dependency we need from map in mvn repository.com uh -huh. and we take uh, necessary uh, excelenium java then cucumber dash java and you have to pick this cucumber dash java and cucumber test ng of same version if you picks up if you pick up different version it will not work okay uh -huh. but don't worry when you are working in your project actually your task lead will provide every dependency you need for your project so we don't need to be worried about what version i will use once we done with necessary um, dependency or software uh, download and installation, what we did, we create feature folder. Uh, in Java, we call it a package and we create it inside src slash test slash resources instead of creating it inside uh, src slash test slash java because feature features are not java java file not Java program. Mm -hmm. It is simply a file. So we created inside resources, but you will find many companies, they are creating it in the same package. You can do it, but best practice is to create in different package inside resources because it is not a Java file. Whatever we are keeping inside test slash Java is Java files, okay? This resources packages to create, those files are not related to Java. So I'm doing the same. Then I just, write all the feature scenario in Gherkin language, then just right button click and run as Cucumber feature. When I run it, it gave me some code snippet that I copy, then create a steps definition folder or package inside src slash test slash java and inside steps folder or package i create step definition file that is in java and i name it steps login test relating to this name okay so that i can understand this feature file is related to this steps definition file file mm -hmm. okay so name it similar to each other so that you can understand because there might be also another login feature it, it, it can be logout feature 
okay or another login feature for uh, correct username and password or you can have more feature files here maybe 10 so make it similar so that you can understand this one is for this and another one is for another one okay so make it as much as similar so that you can uh within short time you can understand it which one is for which one then we we implement the selenium code as part the code snippets we write the real code here right yep then what we did we create another package inside src slash test slash java because this test runner will be a java file okay and we just get public class test runner and we extends abstract test ng cucumber tests from cucumber test ng dependency so it is from test ng and we we are actually inheriting then we using at the red cucumber options and inside the option you are mentioning where is your feature files okay if you have more than like just if you just mention features every feature file will be running if you want to run specific feature file suppose there are 10 features then you have to say login test dot feature you have to mention the name of the file if you want to run only this feature do you understand mm -mm, not clear suppose you have more feature file here mm -hmm. not only one there is another logout feature another one is forgot past feature say for example three features if you just keep up to here features just take it out every feature file will be running but if you just want to run one feature file login task dot feature then if you, you you have to mention it here then it will run only one feature if you say features then it will run whatever you have feature files inside this features whatever feature files inside this feature say for example you have five feature files here mm -hmm. if you just mention features uh -huh. it will run, run five features it will run everything oh okay if you want to run only one feature then you have to specify here which one you want to mm. run it understand it yeah okay fantastic then you have to tell where is the glue code meaning you want to run this feature but where is your actual selenium code so you have to glue together meaning you have to connect together you have to map it so you have to tell with glue keyword equal to where it is inside the steps mm. so whatever you have inside everything will be running then 
if you don't want to ra uh, write inside one line, you can also write like this. This is also allowed. And you want to now make a more robust, more beautiful report, then we have to do some more action here. What we can do to prepare a better report, you can say plugin. And the plugin equal to inside the calibrases, you say HTML slash target, not slash, it is a column. And you want cucumber report. It is actually reports. Cucumber dash reports. And so inside the target, you want a folder to be created and name of the folder is cucumber dash reports. And inside this folder, you want a report and you want to name it cucumber dash html dash reports dot html okay mm -hmm. now just save it Now look, you have only test output. Now we are telling the HTML plugin to go to target and inside the target create cucumber reports folder and inside the cucumber report folder create a report and name of the report is cucumber dash html dash report dot html clear mm -hmm. make sure you save it and then just right button click run as test ng test It's invoking browser, navigating to facebook.com, passing the parameters and clicks. Inside the target, actually you have nothing now. We can see it, right? Nothing. Can you see anything here? No. No. So just refresh it. Nothing, actually. I refresh second time. Actually nothing, sometimes take 10 seconds. I refresh again. Now you see, something is there, right? Yep. Okay, let's go to target. You see cucumber reports. Mm -hmm. We wanted to prepare cucumber dash report and it has been created. 
And inside Cucumber reports, we want to create cucumber-html-report.html. And it is there, cucumber-html-report.html. Right button click. Open with web browser and see it's a beautiful report has been created. Hundred percent pass. Yep. Two minutes ago, and it took only five point five one seconds. And when you click on this drop down, you find everything here. Your feature your scenario and your test steps and everything written in Garkin language. Isn't it better report? Yeah, much easier. I mean, it's just more human readable and like yeah. accurate. Now, what you have to do is you have to practice maybe twice or thrice, then in the next week, we can go for advanced level uh, BDD Cucumber. This is the, uh, I can say this is uh, intermediate level. Mm. If you can do it, you are good enough to work in your project. Maybe in your project, your mm, test it will be telling you just uh, create um, feature files into different different features or if you want you can create another scenario okay you you can create here another scenario in the same file if you want but Many company, they don't want to create mm, scenarios in one feature, but it is also possible if you want. You can say test login functionality with correct password. Okay. And, or you can even test so for example, test title of the application. Something like that, okay? Mm -hmm. And if you run this feature file, this is for the second one, but there is nothing, so 
it giving you you see user get actual title and compare with expected title and that user finds both title matches so this is actually new new code and you can go to steps definition and create new class and just name it Actually, you can do it here, mm -hmm. or you can create another one. Same way, you can even create separate feature file for this one. It's up to you. Okay? Yep. Let's work on it in the next Saturday. Okay. I think this is enough for today. Since it is not glued together or connected or right. mapped, you see there is warning. But given user is on the login page is already mapped because there is one step that is user is on the login page, right? So it is already mapped. Got it. Any question? Yeah, I have I have to digest the material to be honest, you know. Okay. Yeah. So I'm sending this uh video tutorial mm -hmm. within 30 minutes and you can go through it and try maybe once or twice. Yep. It will be enough, I think. And the next, if you don't have time, don't worry. In the okay. next uh, Saturday, we can work it together. I'll okay. be in front of you and you will be practicing. Got it, okay. I just want to make sure you are doing it, okay? Got it, yeah, Um. yeah, we'll see, yep, yep.